Hello everyone, I welcome you all to the Infinite Division platform. Right now I'll be doing one such question that came in your JEE main examination. This question came on 1st September 2021. So this question came on this year only and it, it, uh, it came on second shift. So let us see this question first. Question says a body of mass M dropped from a height H reaches the ground with a speed of 0 0.8 root GH. The value of the work done by the friction, air friction is so that means the question is if a ball any particular body whose mass is m is dropped from a certain height of h it comes down and hit the ground with the speed of 0 0.8 root gh where h is the height through which it has fallen okay so at its highest point its speed is 0 okay so it says what is the work done by frictional force you need to find out the work done by frictional force so, so that means friction must be acting in this situation and it will do the work in negative direction uh, it will do a negative work done why because this motion of the particle is downward and uh, the friction always air friction always acts in opposite to the direction of motion of that particle okay so that means air drag is always acting in the upward direction because since the this block or this ball is coming downward so that means it has to do negative work done because this particle is moving in this direction and for uh, and this uh, this frictional force is in upward direction so this frictional work done must be equal to negative so we already know that one more uh, force is there that is weight of this or you can say gravitational force which is also acting on it so this gravitational force will also do the work so work done by all the forces must be equal to change in kinetic energy of this particle that is the work energy theorem so we can easily write it as work done by gravity plus work done by frictional force must be equal to change in kinetic energy system so half m v square minus half m zero whole square because initially its kinetic energy was zero because its speed is zero at its base this is the velocity with which it will hit the ground okay so we can uh, write the value of work done by mg as because gravity is also acting downward and in the direction of gravity it has to fall h height so the work done by gravity must be equal to must be positive so what should be the work done by gravity it should be m into g multiplied by displacement which is h okay so this is the work done by friction that you need to find out this must be equal to changing kinetic energy so write it uh, write the value of uh, v over here because final speed is this so 0 0.8 root g h whole square so this is the expression that you are getting it should be minus 0 so that means so the expression for uh, the kinetic energy that you are getting is this okay so that means the kinetic energy is zero so you have to solve this expression and eventually you'll get the value of work done by friction so let me just solve this so it must be equal to half m v square so it me it must be equal to half m what is mass over here let it be m only this would be 0 0.64 into gh this term goes comes over here so it becomes m into g into h okay again uh, this would be equivalent to m into g into h this can come out outside because since both the term has got m into g into h so eventually we will be getting as 0 0.32 minus 1 so it would be equivalent to minus of 0 0.68 m into g into h so this is the value of work done by friction that we are getting so the finally the answer would be your first answer that is minus of 0.68 m into g into h so i hope this question is clear to everyone thank you